will be talking to us about. And so let's begin with uh, Emmanuel Tu uh, from our city center studio. Emmanuel Tu, good morning. Kindly talk to us about what we need to expect within the political scene. Well, uh, thank you very much, uh, Brendan. Good morning to you and to our viewers. Uh, we have a lot of activities, of course, in the political front, uh, beginning with uh, uh, the May's uh, debate that has, uh, of course, uh, tra tra traversed different parts and, of course, uh, now making its way to Parliament. Today, we expect that a member of Parliament uh, will be tabling a motion to stop the importation of 10 million bags of maize uh, into the country after that row that has erupted. Uh, remember that uh, the members of Parliament, mostly from the Rift Valley region, the North Rift, have uh, faulted the government's uh, plan to import the maize, saying that it will disenfranchise the, uh, the millions of farmers uh, who are expecting to have a bumper harvest in just about two weeks, and about uh, 35 million bags of maize are expected to be harvested. And, be, uh, and, of and also uh, there are other 20 million bags that are already sitting in stores uh, waiting for purchase from the government. Uh, but uh, the MPs have also uh, maintained that uh, they want the maize that will be bought from the Kenyans uh, to be bought at, at about 4,500 4, shillings uh, or thereabout to give the, the farmers uh, some profit when uh, they, they will be closing the year. Remember, uh, that is the main uh, backbone of this country, farming, and of course, uh, trying to give the farmers uh, something to smile about at the end of the year. So that is the debate that is going to happen today. We expect that uh, the Departmental Committee on Livestock, on Agriculture and Livestock of the National Assembly will be having a sitting from 10 a.m. to discuss some of those issues, uh, including the 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 the, the, the the, the issues concerning uh, the money that were there during the uh, during the election period uh, that were used in different ways in helping the people uh, who are uh, of course affected by the drought. So that is the much that we expect from Parliament. Uh, but we also expect that some activities will be happening out of the country, where President William Ruto is currently in uh, the Republic of Korea. Uh, to engage the president of that country in terms of other issues, including uh, the economic plan that the government has. I remember the Kenya Kwanzaa uh, plan in, uh, that, that includes the, the Hustler Fund uh, launch is expected in about uh, two weeks or so, or one, or one week uh, uh, thereabout, uh, to launch and, of course, give uh, Kenyans 50 billion shillings that they will be borrowing and returning with an interest of 8 per, 8%. So that is the debate that we expect to take the center stage uh, this week and, of course, today. So that is the match we have from uh, uh, the political desk. And uh, hand it over to you, Brenda. Manuel, and of course, our viewers do expect uh, some of those stories that uh, Emmanuel Tours mentioned during our subsequent bulletins. So we go to Nyeri County, bringing Michael Lee 